Hello friends, welcome to CAD Tips. In this video, I am going to describe how combo box items can be added or removed in runtime or through code in WPF using C Sharp. Okay, so drag and drop a combo box from toolbox. Okay, add two buttons. Uh, two buttons from combo box okay which is one is for add item and one is for remove item button click and next add one text box from toolbox okay uh, this is these are the uh, toolbox items that we needed that we needed and, uh, and give a name for combo box so uh, name is the and give a name combo box one okay uh, next uh, give uh, some name for text box okay oh uh, we can add uh, some combo box items uh, by through xaml that we have described in the last video uh, combo box item content equal to combo item one okay that is added in the designer we can see that and next uh, add one more item item two okay this is how we can add in through xml and next uh, we can give a name for text box uh, name equal to text box one okay and we can uh, delete that uh, text uh, text box otherwise when we run it will uh, show text box in the uh, text box so this is how we can add and next give a name for buttons one is add item and one is remove item uh, okay add item and remove item and next we can give uh, click events for uh, both item, both buttons so click equal to uh, button remove item so that we can easily identify that that is if we uh, give button click remove item and add item we can easily uh, recognize uh, differentiate both uh, if we give new when handler it will be like button click one button click two likewise so we can give our own name and go to the definition of uh, button add item we can go to the definition of uh, button add item by right click on go to the definition and we can see two uh, this is uh, that we already created that we can delete it and uh, button add item and inside that we can write combo box one we need to add items into the combo box uh, that we are typing in the text box that is whatever we are typing in the text box one uh, that we need to add when we click on the add item button so combo box one dot add items dot add okay then what is the text that is text box one dot text text inside text box one should be added to the combo box list and we can uh, write uh, give a message box when we add that items that is to items added successfully okay so that we get some uh, information about the item added successfully next is we have a remove item so button remove item go to the definition okay and write the code over here which will be we need to add the uh, remove the items item that we are uh, selecting in the combo box so we need to find out the uh, index of selected item from the combo box okay we can see it uh, combo box items dot remove 
at combo box items that is we need to give the index of selected item selected item is combo box one dot selected item we will get the item selected and we get the index of that item and remove that item okay this is the code and we can give a message box that uh, shows uh, if the uh, item is removed successfully item removed successfully okay and now we can uh, build the application and press start button okay we can see that and we can see item 1 and 2 that we have uh, given in the xaml okay and next we can type any item item suppose item 3 okay and press add item item 3 will be added item added successfully message box is shown and we can see item 3 is added over here and if we uh, type one more item item 4 for example and add item item uh, item 4 is also added so we can see it in the combo box so this is how we can add item and remove item next is remove item suppose uh, if we want to remove item we need to select it in the combo box that is if we want to remove item 2 we need to select item 2 uh, then remove item so item 2's index will be uh, given and item 2 is removed so we can uh, we can see it in the combo box that item 2 is removed okay and if you want to item 3 is removed item 3 select item 3 and it is removed and we can see item 3 is also removed from the combo box list this is how uh, this works that is this is how we can uh, delete this uh, and that is in the remove item it will select the index of selected items in the combo box and in add item it will add the uh, uh, content that we are typed in the text box one and text box one is added this is how it works i hope you understood